About 20 years ago, I discovered Adventist Pioneer Library when I was doing work on my graduate degree in early Adventist history. I hadn't known anything about the work of Fred Bischoff and Adventist Pioneer Library or the collections of materials that were being put together. But as I began doing research on an early Adventist pioneer by the name of Hannah Moore, I was referred to the Adventist Pioneer Library as a place that might have documents I was looking for, the published record about Hannah Moore in church periodicals, including Adventist Review, was pretty slim. And so I began looking in the archives of Adventist Pioneer Library and discovered that there were multiple references unavailable elsewhere that helped enrich my research and gave me whole new directions to turn. Conversations recorded between her and other church leaders, letters that I was able to follow up on. I was in the process of collecting nearly a hundred handwritten letters by Hannah Moore that had been sent around the world to various people, both in Adventist faith and in other faiths, and discovered several new ones through Adventist Pioneer Library. Little had been done researching her work. Today, thanks in part to Adventist Pioneer Library, there's a 500-page dissertation about Hannah Moore and one of these days, hopefully a popular book about her remarkable story. I have to give credit to the people who do the long, patient work to build a resource like Adventist Pioneer Library. It isn't always fun. It doesn't always look rewarding but they do it in hope of that aha moment when someone like me gets to discover in their research something that dramatically opens doors and changes the nature of the way we understand a given period. Because of the things I found in Adventist Pioneer Library, I've been encouraging other young Adventists who have an interest in church history to go and do research projects and contribute their materials to the common good of all of us. There are more wonderful stories waiting to be discovered, faith-inspiring, hope-building stories that are buried in the pages of church archives, things that are still kept in many places in shoeboxes and houses. And as an editor, I've frequently written to editorials to say, put your material out there, give it to an archive like Adventist Pioneer Library or one of the heritage centers so that the richness of the Adventist past and how it can move us into the future will be available to far more than just you and your family. I'm one of those who's been blessed because people did that and specifically because Fred Bischoff took this work on and brought a team together to make it happen. And that the value of that gift and that hard work and that labor is gonna go on until the kingdom.